so much. This is my friend Eric. He's crazy. He thinks this car is gonna be the world's best car, the Tesla yeah. Model oh, S. 100D. 100D. Yeah. Let's see how it goes. Morning. What's up, dog? How's it going? What that does is, if you care, it's a trick, huh? Yeah. That's all I had. This is Troy <laughs> Churchill. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so we call him Scotty. Yeah. We'll, Give it all that you we'll got, Captain. So here's right, what we got. We got the, the, the Phoenix. We got we got the model, and then we got the newest P100D right here. So uh, we're gonna make a really cool video, and thank you, Jehu, for being here. Hey, I'm ready to roll, but we gotta hurry, man. I mean, I got I got Fox 5 News at 12 o'clock in San Diego. We're gonna shoot the cinematic stuff before we actually do the actual race. All right, these guys are running through the script. Yeah. Got a time it just perfect. And rolling and action, out. Got it. Let's go. I see the irony here. Two electric cars at a gas station. What's going on? All right, so this is the part where uh, Eric is being interviewed by the local news. If it breaks, we know how to fix it. So what the hell is happening here? What is all the fuss about, right? Well, let's see if I can explain it. You see Eric back there. He is a recycler, but not just any recycler. He calls himself a hybrid recycler. To explain that, I guess I'd have to kind of go over the ways that things, a product is once it's used up, then you can throw it in a landfill, right? And of course, that, that's the worst thing because then it stays there. No one else uses it, those raw materials. They kind of go to waste, especially when they're electronics. So a better thing to do to recycle electronics is to, well, you know, melt them again or, you know, process them for the raw material. But a lot of the time that's very, very wasteful because the products, sometimes they still have use. They're not completely broken or useless. And that is the case with this sort of electronics, right? With batteries, you're familiar with my channel. We've discovered that 90% of dead laptop batteries have good cells in them, right? So it's the same way with all kinds of electronics. And so what Eric is doing is instead of, instead of processing all these products for the raw materials, it is better to find a use for them. That's why he built this car here, right? The Phoenix, to prove a point. It's basically, it's not about the car. It's not about what type of batteries are in the car. It is, it is to prove the idea that what in the past would have been melted or it would have been processed down to the raw materials, today we can find use for it, right? right? So this proves the point that in America, we are kind of wasteful, right? And we don't have to be because this stuff has value, you know? With very, um, with very minimum amount of money, time, and planning, he built that car. Yeah, it's not the prettiest, it's not the fastest, uh, but it does go farther than a premium, premium product like the Tesla, and right? And we're not saying that Tesla's not good. We are actually big, big fans of Tesla. Uh, Eric has, owns one that he uses, right? And this one he borrowed it to kind of prove that even the top of the line Tesla doesn't go as far as his creation here. So that is what this whole trip is about. And it's generating some interest within the media. In fact, here, right? He's being, um, well, he's being interviewed by the local channel here in San Diego. Roger. Roger. Roger Figueroa from Puerto Rico. Here's what's happening. We're running out of sunlight. And so he's gonna shoot the scene where the Model S runs out of juice. Now, 
that's really going to happen because we are going to get back on the road and eventually it will run out of juice and we will document the whole thing, right? So this is just a lot of shenanigans going on here, uh, but this is really happening. With that scene out of the way now, he's gonna go and we're gonna continue our actual race. Hey. This guy right here, king of the vlogging. <laughs> you guys make sure you keep following this guy. He's a nut. He does every he's just crazy all day filming. Thank you. Crazy. We appreciate you. I'd rather stop tonight, all the red lights all the way back. <laughs> you can drive. No, I gotta, it. I gotta shoot. No, drive and vlog. It's cool. Okay. It's legitimacy. Yeah. If you film the dash, you'll see how many miles are left. Tesla versus trash car. Let's see what happens. Wow. Well, yeah. Come on, buddy. All right, guys. I guess I've been chosen to drive. <laughs> here's what's happening I have seven miles left and there's a supercharged station uh, I don't know like five miles away from here All right the battery's basically gone on this thing hey, look at that zero miles uh, it says battery very low and it went 315.7 miles and it used 93.2 kilowatt hours that means this thing still has what left? Well, 6.8 kilowatt hours. Left. Well, then run it. I literally want you to just drive around in circles until it dies. Well, maybe the battery does, is not really a 100. Maybe there's like some safety there that they put because yeah, most maybe. people. Like, it still has full power. Right now, you punch it, it still goes. Really? Yeah. I bet you if you punch it a couple more times, it'll start acting like a go kart. And then we can put it in neutral and just push it there, you know? <laughs> Did you see the te <laughs> the Tesloids over there? They look pretty mean. Um, it's yeah, like, it's like no. a little cult. They have like stickers and Everybody stuff. Everybody there is wondering why you're oh, why you're about around. to brick a P, you know, 100D. <laughs> we I, it, we'll get everybody over there coming over, looking and wanting to help if we need to push it. You <laughs> no, know, they'll be shaking their heads and be the like, the lights will be like, <laughs> idiots. First time owner or what? Well, bro, I mean, I got one too. I wouldn't want to brick mine, but this one's a lender, right? This is a loaner. So, we got insurance, sort of. <laughs> ah. All right, let's go plug it in. All right, Eric. It's been like 12 hours since we started. It's been a while. <laughs> and uh, 315 miles later, the Tesla is now needing a charge. How's your car doing? Here, come take a look. Come on. 111 volts. What does that mean, Jehu, Mr. Mathematician? I think it still has another 100 miles left in the battery. But there's only one way to tell. She's got to drive it until it just dies. It doesn't go anymore. All right, more than 12 hours later, we're ending up exactly where we began. And how many miles did we go? So far, 341. 341. A but, new world record passed the world record. But we got a long ways to go. So yeah. Let's just uh, ride it until we either break this thing or hit 400 plus. If you watch in the beginning of this video, there's a lot of people and then it starts dwindling down and dwindling down and dwindling down until you have like the last two troopers left. Don't look at me. So ashamed I didn't get the 400. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. That's all she gave us. You get that shit of what it could have been like, yeah. how could I have gotten? So we gotta we gotta check the map tomorrow. We gotta go through every little road and highway and everything. Yeah. Figure out like what the exact mileage is. Yeah. Yeah. But right. it was close. But look, even all my batteries in my camera, they're all dead. They're all dead. They're like about to die. <laughs> like. Man, but we're still up. How how are you still standing, bro? 
Dude, it's just uh... I'm impressed. That's a pretty nice camera you got there. Yeah, it's the iPhone. All right, so that's it. Current time is 3.49 a.m. It's yeah. done, so that's it. There's no more juice in those batteries. Yeah, So. Um... and what was our mileage? What do we think it was? We're not, we gotta go back and look at the maps, but we know for a fact, cause we, we tested it with uh, the Tesla. The Tesla was basically with us after it fully charged and we had some great yeah. Mexican food. Uh, we tested it and what did you get? How many miles? 382. 382. 382. 382 miles on a single charge. Yeah. And we have how many hours of video to prove it? Yeah, there's tons. <laughs> Just hours and hours and hours. He goes, to... he goes, this is the first time I've used up all of my batteries. Every <laughs> single one. That's why you're, I mean, Jehu's on his camera now because of that. My phone. Yeah. My, my real camera is dead. All right, well, thanks, um, man. Thanks for coming out and being a part of this. And, all right. You know, you're a trooper, dude. We got to do it again. We got to hit 400. 400. 400. We went from 340.2 first run yeah. to 382 second run. I added another 20 miles. No, we added 42 miles. Oh, 40, mi oh, 40 miles, yeah, yeah. 42, 41. So we need to add another 20. I have some ideas on what to do, so, yeah. We'll do, we'll do something. Something. We'll yeah. figure it out. We'll do it. All right. Let's sign <laughs> off here. This video has been long enough. <laughs>